hi there Annie ML crossing underscore. Hi there zero zero KY. Hi there stream elements. Hi there Lewis 61589 Hi guys! Hi Lewis, hi Sam, hi Uki, how are you guys doing? <coughs> Someone made a clip already? What for? So yeah, Lewis uh, redeemed <laughs> Lewis was first with the outfit change, so let's see what we're getting into today. Pixel Cafe, hey, how are you? Good afternoon. Have a tea in a little bit. Hi there, yes, I guess zero four. Hey, yes, I guess. How's it going? came too late once more, even though I came running. <laughs> Honestly, like, Uki is here all the time, I feel like. Like, if I look back at the chat, it's just Uki every time. <laughs> oh my gosh! Funny Bubble Tea, hi! No freaking way, thank you so much for the raid! That's a good way to start. Hi! Hey Rock Socks, how's it going? Tushy Face, hi, how are you? Snoot Hall Who? How are you? Raw Smackdown? Jeez, that's an interesting name. <laughs> How's it going, guys? Pixel Ticks, welcome on in. Mop Garden, hi. Hey, Rock Socks, how you how's it going? Thank you for being here. The Cool Guy 201, hi, how's it going? Bunny is our queen, honestly, though. I was, <laughs> I was gonna head into Bunny's stream a little earlier, but I had to, like, do some stuff. Why Bulbasaur? Hi, how's it going? That's such a cute name. I'm gonna say hi to everyone, so just <laughs> bear with me here. Celeste Star, hi, thank you for being here. Thank you for joining in. Wolfie Paws? Oh, that's a cute name. I love that. Welcome on in, everyone. Bunny Bubble Tea, how was your how was your stream? How'd it go? Thank you so much for choosing to raid me. Let me give a quick shout out. There we go. Hi there, night. Who are you playing? I, I, I there, know what you were playing. <laughs> hey, Jeff, how's it going? Hey, Bunny Bubble Tea. 
What's up? Thank you so much for choosing me to raid. How'd it go? How was your stream? Sorry, I had a little bit of a delay, but how are you doing? No problem, no worries. I'm doing good. Honestly, literally just getting started. So <laughs> thank you for already making this an awesome stream. Really appreciate that. It was a lot of fun, a lot of engaging combo. Cool, good to hear. I love that when the when the conversation's good in the streams. Let's see, Jeff, what did you just say? Welcome, you awesome peeps. Oh, I just arrived and I somehow missed a raid five minutes into the stream. Literally, though. <laughs> Alrighty, let's see here. Isabel says, hello there, everyone. Hi. <laughs> right now in Everglow, it's 1.06 p.m. on Wednesday, April 14th, 2021. Today's also Rocket's birthday. I kind of skipped forward in where I was backward. <laughs> She's modest, it was great. She got chicken nuggies. Ooh, that sounds good. Man, I've been looking for good vegetarian chicken nuggets. If anyone has any good recommendations, let me know. Yellow doge? <laughs> what? <laughs> yes, I guess, with the emote. <laughs> I'll hail Godmother Rocket. So, there's a specific reason why I went to this day. Tushy Face, thank you so much for following. And Celeste Star, sorry I didn't mention it, but also thank you so much for following. Bird's Eye Vegan Nuggies? Ooh, I haven't tried those. I'm not sure if they have everything here, you know? I live in the Netherlands, so like, you know, certain brands and stuff. Uh, I'll be back on later. Uh, I'll be back on later tonight. Gotta charge my tablet. Have a great morning, everyone, and see everyone in the next stream. Thank you so much for coming in with the raid, cool guy. <laughs> uh, good luck with charging your tablet. <laughs> Thank you for being here. The raid message switched to chicken nuggies. I guess so. <laughs> That's what it is now. Oh, it Isabel, a yellow. I gotcha. Yellow Doge. <laughs> modified it i like it it's good <laughs> rocket deserves to be hailed honestly though um so yeah um <laughs> let me just explain real quick for all of you new people here um i have an emote it's the one that yes i guess was just showing off oops let me uh Put it in chat as well and this emote was born <laughs> exactly this emote was born out of pure accident honestly <laughs> out of me misspeaking when i tried to say hey there's rocket and zipper was right around the corner i think we were talking about zipper so I, instead of rocket i said ripper <laughs> and well yes i guess took it and ran with it and now we have this emote we need a copy pasta demand command honestly though literally <laughs> I'll, I'll try to figure out how that works the emote was a happy little accident honestly though but yeah so there's definitely a reason why we went to april 14th so we can celebrate rocket's birthday happy birthday and with that i'll get back to work supporting you and your enjoyment of our island Quite the duality. Love it. <laughs> Honestly, though. Uh, I didn't run. I didn't run. I did a whole ass marathon. <laughs> Literally. So, Lewis, you get to choose the outfit today. You were the quickest. We need to try words with friends with all the viewers. <gasps> That's a fun idea. You guys want to do some words on stream real quick? Ripper is better mistake to make than Zocket. Yes. Yeah, I guess that's true. Oh, there we go. <laughs> Miss words with friends. Yeah, so it's going to be words on stream. And thank you, yes, I guess, for uh, redeeming that. Let's go. Let's do some words on stream. Now that we have a whole bunch of people, I think we'll be able to uh, get a couple levels further than usual. <laughs> Supposed to be reading in my textbook. Oh, what are you re reading about? There we go. Now we're in. Let me start it up real quick. Commas? <laughs> Here we go. Let's play some words on stream. Let me turn on the sound effects because I enjoy them. 
How loud is that? It's kind of loud. Level 20, please? Let's try. Alright, so for anyone who doesn't know words on stream, uh, basically you get a string of letters and you try to find words within those letters. And if you find a word, you just type the word in chat. No need to use any commands or anything. Just type it in the chat and it'll show up on the screen. And, um... The rest is pretty self-explanatory. You'll get it pretty, uh, pretty easily. How to place commas and stuff? Oh, okay. I guess that's kind of interesting. <laughs> Alrighty. Let's go for it. There we go. Yeah, I was looking at Harn, too. Nice. I was gonna go for Nark, too. <laughs> Let's see here. Let's see if that's a word. No, it's not. Um, let's see here. Archon. That would have been a really good one. Ooh, nice one, Celeste. Cool him. <laughs> oh, I see one. There we go. We made it through level one. <laughs> Rogue Kate, thank you so much for following. I really appreciate that. How are you today? Anchor. Nice. Good one. Um, is that a word? Nope. Good one, ranch. Hey, they call me B. <laughs> Should I call you B? Um... Okay, that one doesn't count. Nope. Nice. We got through this one, I think. Probably at least two stars. No arc. <laughs> hey, Darboticus, how are you? Welcome on in. Nice job, yes, I guess. Jeff, nice one. Good job, guys. Alright, next one. I see corn dog, but that's not in there. <laughs> Ponder, nice one. Hmm. Ooh, nice. Moon Gods, thank you so much for following. How are you? That's such a pretty name. There we go. Uh, you can, my name is Brittany, but my friends call me B. Oh, okay, that's a pretty name too, Brittany. I like that. Thank you so much for following too. Pruned cool cat. <laughs> um, let's see here. Thorn. Guess that's not a word. Nice. We made it through another level. Rude. <laughs> Cordon. Nice. Just trying stuff out now. What is Ron? No, no idea. <laughs> Most of the time, I'm like, nah, I don't know. In any case, we made it through, so that's good. Coden. Also, don't know what that is. I think maybe even three stars on this one, honestly. Nice job, guys. No clue what Coden is, but it worked. Ooh, nice one. Nice last second one, Celeste. No clue what Coden is, but it worked. 
<laughs> Literally. Like, what even is that? Celeste Star, nice one. Topping the charts here. Jeff, good one. Uki, too. Who do we have in number one now? Celeste, nice. Good job, guys. Imagine not spelling Odor <laughs> with a U, exactly. Um, ooh. Let's see here. I need to beat Celeste. Go for it. Believe in you. Wow. Nice job, guys. There we go. I got one, too. <laughs> now we gotta wait. There we go. Um... Guess that doesn't count. Was that already in there? Oh, it was. Oh, nice. <laughs> um, there we go. Apparently that's a word. Boy, hi, how's it going? Welcome on in. Thanks for competing. Sewer, nice. Everything I think of is already said. Same, honestly. <laughs> Taria AU. Thank you for joining in. It was... I don't know. I don't know half of the words in here. <laughs> Ooh, nice one. Ooh, -er. Nice. Another three stars. I think we'll make it to the 20, uh... To the level 20 this time. Celeste doing so good in the total ranking. Toshi face. Nice one. Number one in this one. Celeste, number two, and yes, I guess, number three. You're gonna beat... Eh, hard to say. Hard to say. <laughs> but you're catching up for sure. Celeste carry us, honestly. <laughs> okay, so in this one, there's a fake letter, so one of the letters isn't gonna work. Gee, there's a lot of letters in this one. I think that might be in there. Well, if advanced is in there... Come on, unlock. There we go. <laughs> um, oh, am I locked? I am locked. Alright, so the B is fake. That one was already guessed. Alright, alright, alright. A word? <laughs> Guess not. Hmm. We got through it in any case, so good job, guys. Oh, that one's already in. I don't see anything anymore. Acne. Nice one. Nice. Good last second one, guys. Caved. Good job. That's gonna be another three star, isn't it? Nice. <laughs> nice job, guys. Pixel Cafe, you did really good in this one. Really failed here? You're still in number one place. 
in any case, you did good. Natari Nataria AU. Nice nice going. You really came in there. Good job, guys. Let's go on to the next one. I feel like I'm throwing. Yeah, you're doing good, bud. You're in number two. Um... Yeah. How do you spell that word? Camping. Yeah, that one's already guessed. Um... Let's see here. That one's already guessed. <laughs> Dang, this one's kind of hard. see anything okay so the J is fake good to know I can't I don't see anything pica is a is a not a, a disease but a condition where um, you eat things that you're not supposed to eat Yuki Uh, all the four-letter words are also already got. That's a word? Why is that a word? <laughs> In any case, we got through it. Good job, guys. Gaming. <laughs> I was like, I'm just gonna throw that one in there. We'll see if we can get something from it. Nice! Still two stars. Pixel Cafe really dominated this one. Good job. Ooh, wow, you really just kind of pushed it pushed us out of the ranking, huh? That one was hard. It was a hard one. Missing the apostrophe? Yeah, I guess so. <laughs> we need a dictionary bot, just one that just puts every word in here. I'm doing a suck today. Ah, it's fine. You're still doing good. Love words on stream? Me too. I think it's really fun. Worked on the five words everyone else looking at fours. I feel like four-letter words are so much easier for me to see. Oh, this one's gonna be hard, isn't it? Um. Okay, so this one has a real letter. Or it has a fake letter and a hidden letter. Yeah, this one's gonna be hard. Um, large, nice one. Okay, so it's not I, probably. Hey there, hey there, Elise Cakey. Thank you for joining in. That's a word. I guess it's not a word. I feel like I'm typing in real words. No N? No N. Okay, good to know. Lair. Good one. We need a couple more. Yeah, N is probably fake. can't find anything. I don't see anything. Nice one. One more letter. One more word is all we need. Okay. Greg. Come on, guys. One more. Nice. Nice one, Tushy Face. You saved the game. <laughs> Thank you. 
Let me drink some coffee before it's ice cold. Pixel Cafe, you carried us in here. <laughs> but Tushy Face, like, got us through it. <laughs> Just trying to work on what was missing. Yeah, that was a hard one. Coffee, I know, I need to drink my coffee. Pixel Cafe, dang man, you're doing so good. You only get the last letter with second. I know, crazy, right? Nice job, guys. It gets harder for sure. Um. Alright, so we have another fake letter. And another hidden letter. Um. <laughs> Finance. Nice one. <laughs> I don't see it. Oh, so the fake letter is C. Not that that's helping me at all. I, I don't see anything. Oh, I, I think I see one. No, because there's no two E's. <laughs> Dang. J is fake? Okay, good to know. Why is it nine a word? Or is it- oh, it was already in. Jeez, man, I don't see any of them. But I'm glad you guys got them. K9, good one, man. Click in G Fuel, please. <laughs> I've never tried G Fuel. Have any of you guys actually, like, tried G Fuel? I... Uh... No, I don't see any. <laughs> Highly recommend the strawberry shortcake. Oh, okay. Maybe I'll have to check it out at some point. I hate lingo. <laughs> I wonder if that's a game anywhere else. Uh, lingo is, as far as I know, a Dutch game that's pretty much this. Nice job, Pixel Cafe. Yeah, I don't know why fence wasn't a word. Maybe someone had already put it in. Who do we have? Pixel Cafe, Celeste, and Tushy Face are leading the board. And then Pixel Cafe, Nataria, and Darboticus did really good in these rounds. We're already further than any level we've ever been, so nice going, guys. Alright, let's see here. Same deal as last one. Mm. Let's see here. Why are none of my words good? Maybe the S is fake. I think the S is fake, guys. Yeah. Um, that makes it really hard. Why is fire not a word? Oh, because it's all five letter words. Crisis. Uh, you guys, I don't see anything. Oh my gosh. Trying to think of the hidden letter. I'm trying to see anything at all. Okay, so P. Ah. Oh, 
man, that was so close. Good job, Pixel Cafe. You really got that at the last second, but it's too bad we didn't make it through. Good job, though. Level 17 is further than we've ever gotten. That was whack. Man, you did really good with that pacifier. Alright, let's see how we did. Pixel Cafe number one with 130, I'm big time too. We never make it level 20, I'm not amused. Soon, I'm sure we will at some point. <laughs> that was fun though, guys. Thank you for joining in on that. Celeste Star, really good. And Tushy Face are our top threes. Jeff, number four. Nice, guys. Good job. As long as I'm above Uki, I'm satisfied. <laughs> Y'all did good. I'm glad you guys all uh, joined in. Gotta go back to work? Alright, sounds good, Pixel Cafe. Thank you so much for joining in and carrying us. <laughs> I'm under Annie, don't talk to me. <laughs> Honestly, that's only a problem if we're playing Mario Kart. Ooh, puppy cam? Alright. Let's do some puppy cam. Oops, that's the wrong... Nope, that's also the wrong one. There we go. <laughs> We're just doing all the redemptions today. So you guys, another redemption that we have available is our puppy cam. And this is this is it. We get to look at live puppies. <laughs> Let me turn off the the words on stream music. Aren't they cute? Aren't they just the sweetest little babies? Let me turn on some background music for this. <laughs> Soon fruit bird cam. Just you wait. Oh, dang it! I, rem I knew I forgot to do something. You know what? Well, let me see if I can set that up real quick. The fruit bird cam. While we watch the puppies. See if I can get that done. At this rate, the new people will never get to see any play. Honestly, though, but... <laughs> it's fine. First be a loser at P place four. I get the part participation trophy. Oh, it's fine. You did good. At this rate, the yeah. She also plays AC sometimes. Every once in a while, I get to get some AC in there. <laughs> Let's see here. Where is Fruit Bird? Mario Cam, Tropical Leaf. Where's Fruit Bird? I don't see fruit bird. Flamingo cam, jellyfish tank. It's more like a redemption for AC. <laughs> Honestly, though. Kinda, yeah. I see bald eagles. I see tropical fish. California condor. Penguin cam. Is this it? Oh, there we go. Panama fruit feeder. That's gotta be it. That's gotta be it. <laughs> the puppies are just kind of off screen right now. Oh well. Jellyfish sounds fun. Yeah, I want to add that one too, but this one first. Did you happen upon one of the Sanrio char characters? No, not yet. I haven't gotten the um, the amiibo cards yet, but I'm kind of thinking about getting them. As long as the ducky lives. Louis, you're you're gonna get your your outfit changed soon. I promise. <laughs> hey, mermaid, how are you? Joined right on time, puppy cam. <laughs> you chose the right moment. Is it alright if Sam picks out the outfit? All I care about is the ducky being green. Sounds good to me, Sam. If you're still here, you get to choose the outfit. Was there one in particular you wanted? I don't want some of mine. Um. I don't know. Not really, honestly. I was just kind of thinking about getting them and seeing what, what's going on with them. But thank you so much for offering. Jellyfish is my other favorite. Jellyfish sounds cool, too. I live for turtles eating berries and tomatoes. Oh my gosh, turtles eating anything is so cute. How's your day, mermaid? So sorry, by the way, if I miss anything in chat. Um, if I do, feel free to post it again. 
there's a Dutch seller on Etsy who has very good products. Oh, good one. Thank you for letting me know. You can't give away the Sanrio villagers? Oh. Yeah, I guess the cards, but... Alright, let me try to... Figure this one out. There we go. There's no birds in the... Cam right now, but that's okay. Whoa, what the heck? Oh, there we go. Just opened something weird. Cute puppy. So cute though, right? I turned on music, but there we go. There it is. I hate when food bird is birdless. There's one bird right now. <laughs> Alright, let's see if I can figure this one out. That puppy looking at himself in the mirror. So vain, but so cute. As he should be. We need to redeem for, uh, redeem for Fruit Bird. Soon. Uh, let me see how this is set up, and then I'll try to do the same. See if this is actually gonna work. Uh, let me the 1080. Oh heck! What did I just do? There's fruit bird. There we go. <laughs> I made fruit bird. Let's go back to puppies though. <laughs> um, actually, let's go to Fruit Bird real quick. Size that down. Make it fit in the screen. There. Something like that. <laughs> and now I will add it to the things. Meanwhile, you guys just get some nice- oh my gosh, wait, why is Fruit Bird so loud? And why do I still hear it? Um... Bear with me here, guys. <laughs> there we go. I'm just gonna say, ugliest outfit you can make with duck. <laughs> well, we'll see. We'll see what happens. I bought a beak for my character and made a face paint of two red circles, and now I'm Molly's sister. Oh, that's so cute. Good job. <laughs> I haven't seen Sam comment anymore, so I'm not sure if he's still here. Um, why do I still hear Fruit Bird? Is this why? You'll hear it in your sleep, honestly, though. You can never leave Fruit Bird. Uh, let me just... I don't know how to deal with Fruit Bird. <laughs> Why is it making so much noise? And how do I stop it from making so much noise? You guys are getting a nice long puppy, uh, long puppy cam. <laughs> oh, maybe if I go to properties. No. <laughs> I don't know how to mute fu a fruit bird. <laughs> I got the outfit changed, and you just keep my ducky green. Sounds good. Um, if Sam isn't here anymore, then I'll let you choose the outfit as well. 
We want a nice long fruit bird? I mean, we can do that too. There we go. There was a squirrel here just a second ago. We'll see if we can get that squirrel back. My puppy is looking at himself in the mirror and he was like, what are you looking at? <laughs> um, I can't figure out where the sound is coming from. Why is it making so much noise? There's not even any birds. Yeah, the bird's gone. Let's go back to puppy camp for a sec. <laughs> Did you mute it in your equalizer in your sound settings on desktop? No, I don't think I did, but I also haven't figured out how to do that yet. Like in one stream, in one, um, maybe the settings for input or output. Let me just, real quick. So, um, I have a fruit bird cam. Yes. This is fruit bird cam. Yes. And I can't stop make it's it, I can't stop it making noise. <laughs> I don't know how to not have it make noise. Um, wait. If you click on this one real quick. Hi there, Loki. Hey, Loki. Yes, I guess says hello disembodied voice. <laughs> that wasn't my hand. That was disembodied hand. <laughs> oh, there's some Animal Crossing, which I haven't gotten to play at all in the last 40 minutes. <laughs> it's not open anywhere else. No, it's just fruit bird. But it keeps making noise. I don't know how to stop it from doing that. Oh. Ta -da. Did that fix it? Because this one, the puppies don't have any sound, I think. Doesn't matter, we do the same thing. All right. So, puppies. Now we got puppies. And Fruit Bird doesn't make any noise either. Nice. And now it's making noise. Oh. Now it is. Nice, thank you. Uh, although I did put it on the reload, uh, so maybe I should disable that. Everyone say thank you, boyfriend, for fixing fruit bird cam. <laughs> now I just have to add it as a yeah, Hi there, Inverter17. Hi, Inverter. <laughs> <laughs> thank you, disembodied voice. <laughs> Now right. I'm gonna add it as a thing. That should do it. Thank you so much for helping. You're welcome. Tech support boyfriends. We got a tech support boyfriend and he made it so we can actually have fruit bird cam now. <laughs> Ducky is life, Ducky is love. Thank you, bodiless voice. <laughs> he says you're welcome. Beautiful boyfriend, save us from eternal fruit bird heaven. <laughs> Loki, what the heck is that clip? Loki, how are you doing? Thank you for coming on in. Sorry for the chaos. But look at that, fruit birds. Now, let me add it as a channel point redemption. Oops, that's the wrong one. How much is puppy cam? 1500? We'll do the same for fruit bird cam. There we go. And there you go. There's Fruit Bird Cam. I think if you refresh now, it should just be there. 
There was a bird for just a sec, but it was there. Good, just eating a sandwich and laughing at the chaos. <laughs> I'm glad at least it's entertaining. <laughs> All right, bye fruit birds. Let's <laughs> play some Animal Crossing. <laughs> uh, if you don't mind me asking, where is this in a general aspect located? In Panama. The fruit birds are in Panama. <laughs> Lewis, why don't you choose an outfit for us, huh? 23 Nook Mile tickets used this morning and I found Tipper. Nice! Congrats on getting Tipper! I know you were looking for Tipper. Is Tipper a boy villager or a girl villager? <laughs> now for the hundred, uh, other hundred cams I collected. I'll deal with those in a little bit, but I feel like fruit bird cam was, uh, was the most imper important one. Tipper is a girl? Well, congrats on getting our girl Tipper. Uki's got it picked out? All right. All I know is it has to be a green duck. Besides that, all is up for grabs. <laughs> Ducky, ugly, green. Sounds good. What do we want to start with? Tops or do we want to dress? Tipper is a snooty cowgirl. Girl cow, not cowgirl. <laughs> duck cam is the most important. I haven't found duck cam yet. I'm going to have to try to find that one. Put on your ugliest outfit. All right, all right, all right, all right. Let's see what we can do. I think this shirt is pretty ugly, but we'll see what else I can uh, get. What what kind of ugly are we going for here? Because there's also like the comedian's outfit, which is which is something. <laughs> Did not find a duck cam, but found platypus. Ooh, platypus cam is kind of cool too. The whole time I thought Tipper was normal. Seems like it would be normal, was doesn't it? Like the ugly duckling. Does, should we do like a, a duck themed outfit? Can you find a red panda cam? That'd be kind of cool. <laughs> what are we thinking of uh, this comedian's outfit thing? Like you are a semi aquatic egg laying mammal of action. <laughs> Only regular panda fan? I mean, regular pandas are cool too. All right, what what gives me ugly duck? As long as not, nothing matches. All right, what gives me ugly duck? I think the comedian outfit is pretty dang ugly. We'll get it to not match with botanical shorts. Either botanical shorts or camo pants. What do you guys think? <laughs> I think those are probably going to be the ugliest pants I have. I guess there's also this dreamy pants situation. Make your mom ashamed to have birth you or stop sending you letters. The flower skirt? All right, we can do the flower skirt. Sounds good. Let's go for headwear then. Headwear next. Ooh, we got a fancy hat. That's really something. We could go for bicycle helmet. Hideous. Hmm. There's also, of course, a grape hat. You know what? Yes. Grape hat. Do you guys know? <laughs> okay. There's a reason why grape hat is a good choice. Do you guys know the, like, nursery rhyme type of song that's, like, the duck going up to the lemon stand and lemonade stand and asking for grapes? Doll eye mask? All right. Unicorn camp could be nice. Ah, I, I wish. Got any grapes? <laughs> exactly. Unless there's something better. Doubt you can top that. Well, let's see. Let's see what we can do here. There's always funny glasses, which... Yikes. But let's see. What other type of glasses do we have? Snorkel mask isn't going to work with the duck bill. We have ski goggles. We have shamrock sunglasses. Star, star shades. Yeah, I think probably 
this one is going to be the ugliest. Shamrock is good too. I like Shamrock because we can still kind of see the hearts, you know? Should we keep uh, Shamrock? Let's go for some socks. What are some ugly socks? I mean, I don't know if we'll be able to see the running tights at all, but I like knowing that they're there, because those are pretty much the ugliest things I own. Nordic socks or something? Ooh, that's true. Could go for like... I feel like the gray ones match the least, because <laughs> the rest of them just the green next to the red. All right, we'll go for green. <laughs> How about shoes? What ugly shoes do we have? They match but are also ugly. Should we do ones that don't match? Like the blue ones maybe? Those at least don't match. <laughs> Let's see, what do we have for shoes? I mean, I think- oh heck. I hate it when that happens! Regular blue is too good? Alright. We'll get- we'll get it back, it's fine. Pink cowgirl boots? Ooh, it's a good idea. Alright, let's go back, get the orange comedian's outfit, the floral skirt, the blue Nordic socks. I feel like I missed it. Pink cowgirl boots is such a good choice, too. <laughs> It might, it might obscure the socks, though, so we'll have to see how that goes. Do you have any ugly custom designs? Only the basic ones. Not really any interesting ones, I think. Uh, what do I have for hat? Oh yeah, grapes. That's right, of course. How could I forget? Then the shamrock glasses. The dark blue Nordic socks. There we go. <laughs> Some pink cowgirl boots. Oh, oh, what a look. <laughs> Do we have anything else that might be even uglier? I mean, I can't imagine, but... I saw the naked mole rat cam. That one might be interesting, too. I could add that one, too. Red jester shoes? Ooh. Uh... Do you mean the... Where are they? these? Because those are pretty dang good, too. Ooh, fox cam would be fun. Yeah, sure. I'll add them all. You guys can just choose whatever you feel like seeing at the po at that moment. Didn't find fox cam? What are we thinking? The mage's bo booties or the pink cowboy boots? In any case. Lynx, tiger, dragon? Dragon cam? It's gotta be something like that. Mage shoes? Alright, we'll do mage shoes. Those are truly something. And then we got a couple of bags. I mean... it's a pretty good one. Red looks good? Alright, we'll go for red. The butterfly backpack is such a classic. Wings? We can go for wings. So, the problem is... That wings hands down? Alright. Sounds good. See, the problem is, the green ones match the glasses. The orange ones match the jacket. The black ones, I guess, only match... No, they only match the hearts. So that's good. If we want something that matches as little as possible. Black? Alright. <laughs> Is this it? Is this the look? Let me know. Confirm. <laughs> Get rid of the hearts? Oh no! Ooh, the, yeah, but the great bag would ma match too much with the <laughs> with the hat, I think. Oh, can't have the hearts. Dang, it's a bummer. Uh, how do I even get rid of the hearts? Hearts are fine? Oh, okay. We'll keep the hearts then. Alright, I had a request 
from Lewis himself to be green. So we're going for a green ducky. Don't go that far. We still gotta be me. I mean... <laughs> The only requirements we got from the Redeemer himself was green and duck, so what are we doing with hair? Make it not that. Alright, alright, alright. What are we thinking of? We got like something like this. We got... I always love this messy haircut. Ugly. <laughs> Just ugly. I think this one's pretty bad. I mean, I don't know if the pigtails will show up. Yeah, the pigtails won't show up. I think this one is maybe the worst one, but we'll see. Let's see here. What is this? Nah, that doesn't show up either. I mean, we could always go bald. Just grapes for hair. A fade. <laughs> Could go bald. Do we want grapes for hair? It's kind of look. <laughs> this is also how I'm going to be showing up to Rocket's birthday party. Just so you guys know. Mother of Ripper is going to be seeing this. The other thing is, we can't play with hair colors if we go bald. He looked like one of Tom Nook's bell collectors. <laughs> what? See, the thing is, if we go with this one, which is also a terrible haircut, we can play around with hair colors. So, we have to choose between grapes for hair or fun hair colors. Ugly hair? Alright. Then what color? This one's pretty. I like this color. This, like, grayish blue. Or bluish gray. It's kind of a nice color. I'd like that, like, just in real life. Green hair? Alright. Go with some green hair. <laughs> hey! No hate for green hair! <laughs> oh, wait. We're hating on gray hair. Okay, that's fair. It matches? Alright. Can't have matching. How about bluish? Bluish green. Red hair? Do red. That's very off color, so I mean, that works. <laughs> red? Uki, you get you get the final choice. Are we going for red? <laughs> Oh, you have a plan. Alright, alright, alright. Top right. You mean like this color gray? <laughs> yeah, that's something too. For sure, that's something. Man, I think I think red might clash more, to be honest. If we're talking which is worse. I mean the gray is plain. <laughs> I think the red one is, it, it just clashes more. Hides too much, exactly. Is this our look? <laughs> I'd like to keep like the eyes and face and stuff the way we have it, so it still like is me, just in this, this. I think that's the look, guys. I think that's it for t <laughs> Look at that. I think we did it. I think we chose the worst outfit in Animal Crossing. That's the legacy. <laughs> Sick. <laughs> Alright, now let's go get a present for Rocket. I got Rocket's picture yesterday, so... By giving him a rocket, which was honestly I should have waited for today, because that would have been like the best time to give Rocket a rocket as a present, but whatever. Molly has given me a gift! What a sweetheart! <laughs> I know, right, Loki Uke? Just wow. <laughs> Something for Annie. Surprise, it's a rug! 
I read a short story about a flying carpet recently and bought this in a moment of literal imp literary impulse. My biggest vice. No, the rug can't fly, but it can be the backbone of great home decor. I do wish it could fly. Molly. No, I never delete my mail. It just gets deleted by, by itself, okay? <laughs> I don't want to delete my mail. When they give you their picture, is that meaningful? Bangle gave me hers. Really? Um, yeah, that means that you've gotten the highest level of friendship you can with your characters. Red small round mat. Oh, cute. I think that might go nicely in the kitchen. Let me check that out real quick before we go over to Rocket's house. That means you can net them now. <laughs> that means you can kick them off your island now. Because, like, I have the red toaster, so that's why I'm thinking this might look nice. Let's see here. Those pockets. Oh, that's cute! I like that. Yeah, it's really cool. Congrats on getting that. I like this. I like it in any place I put it, basically. But yeah, it's hard to get. Rocket was literally one of my first two villagers. Fun kitchen, thank you. I think I like it the most over here by the fridge. I really like the contrast of the yellow and the red. I think that looks nice. Put it across from the red stove up. I don't think it'll fit there, since I already have the yellow mat there. But I think this balances out the colors nicely, since I have the red toaster in the corner, the red plant in this one, and the red sofa on that side. Nice. Alright, cool. Oh, okay. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Well, it only took me an hour to finish my coffee. That's not that bad. <laughs> Better than usually. Alrighty. <laughs> Time to head out and get Rocket a gift. When is room decoration redemption? Uh, honestly, I don't think I'll do that one. Because, like, all my rooms are really decorated the way I like them right now. And I, like, kind of worked hard on those. So I don't think I'll be doing that one. Maybe I'll... Ooh. You know what might be fun, though? <clears throat> it would be fun to get another character on my island and have a house for that one that we get that we could decorate. That'd be fun. Paper tiger? You like the paper tiger? <laughs> I mean, I guess we could do boyfriend's house, but I don't know if he would appreciate that. What do we have here? We have a chemistry set, we have a piano, we have a fish paper tiger and an amp. What is the correct what 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 should we give Rocket? I feel like the fish is the best gift for Rocket. I have one in my house as a pet. That's cute. I like that. Like he'll ever notice. Probably not, but if he ever does, I don't think he'll appreciate it. <laughs> I think I think the fish is Rocket's birthday present. Mounted black bass. Sounds good to me. Might not be the most expensive one, but I think it'll be the one he appreciates most. <laughs> Give me back my filet of fish. Give me my fish. Uki! We already lost the game yesterday. Did you have to? <laughs> what made you think of it? Also, all of you lost the game now. If you know what I mean, you lost. Yellow wrapping paper for sure. This one. <laughs> so yeah, good luck with that. Good luck with getting your streak back. Because of me yesterday. <laughs> I'm doing my homework, you have no heart, Annie. Hey, this one's not my fault. This one's Uki's fault. The 
fish commercial? That's what made you lose the game? <laughs> Man, I probably haven't lost the game for like years. And then I think I was actually the one who brought it up. <laughs> the first time that I lost the game and now you guys lost it too. All right, heading over to Rocket's house, shovel in hand. Let's go celebrate the mother of Ripper. <laughs> oh! Hanging out with Hugh. I feel like Hugh is everyone's best friend on this island. That's why Hugh is never leaving. Yo, Chief, you made it. The party's just getting started, so get ready to rock till you squawk. Squawk. What? She's so happy. Did you wrap the gift? I did wrap the gift. Absolutely. Look at how cute Rocket looks in that dress. She looks amazing. Also, you look so good, too. <laughs> Say hi. Say hi, Ripper. <laughs> Say happy birthday to your mom. I'm afraid to redeem Fruit Bird. They may be birdless. Ooh. That's a good point. Maybe I should make Fruit Bird? No, I'm not gonna do that. I'm not gonna make Fruit Bird more, more accessible than Puppy Cam. <laughs> Getting everyone together like this is so awesome. I could just explode. They even brought gifts. Oh, uh, you didn't happen to bring me something, did ya? Of course. But then I'd spam Fruit Bird. Maybe I should make that a, pro a, a situation, too, where you can't spam them. I'm not a gambler. Hmm. Maybe I'll make it less expensive, but that you can only redeem it, like, once an hour or something. Wow, you've got some real rapping talent. I almost hate to wreck this, but I've got to see what's in there. Can I spam multiple cams? I guess technically, yes? A mounted black bass. I love your thinking. This is really awesome of you. It was great having you here. This birthday totally rocked. Okay, that's it, I guess. <laughs> Hi, Hugh. It's Rocket's birthday today. Let's make her birthday as unforgettable as my sixth... Sixth birthday? That's when the birthday clown went in our house and never came out. Excuse me? That's when what happened? <laughs> <laughs> Mom says they still hear honking noises in the <laughs> They still hear honking noises in the walls sometime. I think that's enough birthday for today. What the heck? <laughs> what? Oh, I blew out the candles. I don't think I was supposed to do that. Well, <laughs> happy birthday, Rocket. Actually, Rocket's house looks really good right now. <laughs> Where did your birthday clown go? We're leaving already, but the party's just getting good. Oh well, thanks for coming out. And <laughs> thanks a ton for the present. You told me to leave! Friend? I don't know where the birthday clown went, okay? I never had a birthday clown. I don't think I ever really wanted one, to be honest. Love birthday celebrations. They're fun. I like them in Animal Crossing. I think they're cute. Alrighty, let me go search for the message bottle. You ruined Rocket's birthday by blowing out their candles. Yeah, but I lit them again, so it's okay. <laughs> Promise. <laughs> it's all good. Message bottle isn't here. Let me go into the side route. Go through the pipe. Hello. Through the pipe. This is convenient. I do like the pipes. So you guys, the 2.0 uh, update is supposed to be coming out fairly soon. What do you guys think? What are you expecting from it? Do you think anything big will happen, or if it's just gonna be like a big disappointment? Oh, that was weird. The music just cut out for a second there. I think... 
I think it'll be announced fairly soon, probably in May. And I also think we're going to see... Um, what's his name come in? <laughs> Dang it, I can't think of the name. The... Brewster. That's the one I'm thinking of. I also saw Balloon just now, so let me try and grab that. Yeah, it's gonna fall into the flowers if I do it here. There we go. Good. Got it. Five thousand bells. Alright, well that's cool, I guess. See the message bottle over here. Oh. A friend has washed up on the shore. Let's go help him. To whoever found this, I really wanted to make an item as, like, an homage to my favorite pop star and came up with this recipe. I'll share it with you since you found this bottle. Go get your arts and crafts on. From Pinky, a creative. Garden wagon. <gasps> yes! Finally! Oh my gosh, I've been wanting this DIY for so long. That's awesome. I'm very happy with that. Yes. Thanks, yes, I guess. Nice. I've been looking forward to getting this one, so I'm very happy with this. I need three white hyacinths, three red cosmos, three yellow roses, some wood, and some iron nuggets. Imagine missing a DIY. Oh my gosh, that's so weird. <laughs> hey friend, wake up. The waves, the waves are ugh, ready. The pool noodles. Ugh. Ugh. Who's at the helm? Just give me five more minutes. Ugh. Ugh. Waiter, somebody put salt in this water. Ugh. Honk shoe, honk shoe, snoring sounds, etc. Uki, do you have all the DIYs now? Snurk, snurk. Sorry, fellas, I already licked all these cookies. Had to test for raisins. <laughs> Probably close to enough rusted parts for a second robot hero? Sick. I don't have any of the robot heroes, but I haven't really been collecting either, so... I don't know. Uh. I'm missing 10, including the Crescent Moon Chair I'm farming. Oh, I think I have the Crescent Moon Chair. No, don't make me go back to space. It's cold and dark and... Huh? TV Johnny Cat, thank you so much for following. How are you today? I'm not in space? Whew. Good old terra firma. Oh, it's you, Annie. Were you the one who jabbed me awake just now? Thanks. Also, ow. What's up, Uki? Five art space reference. <laughs> Wait, are you thinking what I think you're thinking? Feels like my cage got rattled pretty bad. Must have bonked the old noggin as I fell overboard. Maybe the pain will fade if I keep talking. <laughs> oh, oh, laughing bad. Laughing equals bad. Ooh. Will you hang out with me until the hurting stops? You've got a face that screams ample free time. Yikes. Don't call me out like that, Gulliver. So, as I was saying, I must have slipped over the side of my boat. If you're thinking I'm thinking when I'm thinking, then yes. <laughs> I'm thinking... Didn't they talk about water a lot before we got the ocean update? Could it be that we get a space update? Would that be totally out of the realms of possibility for Animal Crossing? Or could it be that we actually get space travel? That's not what you were thinking? <laughs> That's what I'm thinking. I have no idea where my ship is right now. The crew must be worried sick. That's not it? Well, what are you thinking then? Never, feel, never fear, we'll be reunited in a jiffy. I guess it could also be that Celeste gets her own stargazing area. That'd be cool too. You know what it means? What does it mean, then? I'll just call for help using my handy-dandy, uh, my, uh... Oh my gosh. My handy-dandy communicator is broken. This isn't handy or dandy. Ah, oh, sardines, it's all cracked and busted. Looks like it's missing a few communicator parts, too. That means I'll have to wait for my crew to find me on their own. 
Ugh, that could take a while. I've only got a cup. I've only got enough nautical puns for to last for a couple hours. You had to shoot down a UFO with a slingshot before. That sounds cool. Was that for like an event or for something else? Gulliver was in it, and you had to find his UFO part. That sounds really cool. I'm begging you here. Will you look for my? Will you look for my communicator part parts, please? I'll look for them. Sure, buddy. Really? Wow. I haven't gotten a reception this sweet and bubbly since I washed up that old coral cola. The communicator. Com wow, I can't talk. The communicator parts are probably buried in the sand somewhere. I'm just missing five parts. If you'll find them, I'll try to cram them back in there. I'm sure my crewmates are looking for me, so I'd better stay here and watch for the boat. I'll leave the, I'll leave the searching to you. I believe in you, partner. I don't have much of a choice. Now he's referencing it? I guess so, huh? That's exciting. I hope that's actually what it'll, what it'll be. That'd be really cool. But was it for an event, or was that just something that happened in general, or like, just how Gulliver is now that it's like an NPC visit? I can't see anything through all these flowers. I think it was just for Gulliver. Oh, that sounds cool. I'd like that. I'd like more space referencing in the game. I'd also like if Celeste got her own situation. Her own space situation. That'd be really cool. I saw a UFO sometimes in Wild World, but I never found Gulliver because I sucked. <laughs> Wait, so you had to find Gulliver? And also shoot down the UFOs? How did that work? She had her own in Wild World? I know about that, and that's so annoying that she doesn't right now. She deserves it. There's one. Close that up. I see another opening here. I don't know if that'll actually... Oh, that's two next to each other. Sick. That's two. Let me make custom constellations again. That'd be so cool! Man, I wonder why they didn't put those type of things in the main game already. Like, why are they making us wait for stuff like that? Gosh, what an outfit. <laughs> Alright, we got three parts now. Oop, that might be one. Four. Nice, nice, nice. I'm getting these quickly. It usually takes me a couple runs. Hey, friend. They made us wait for red. That's right. And for leaf. Not fair. Alright, I don't see the last one over here. And where is it? Let's see if I can find it. Where did I get all five? I didn't write. No, I got four. I wonder if you could save communicator parts. Like, if you don't find all of them one week when- or, like, one time when Gulliver comes over, if you can give them to him the next time. I just want bushes that are either flowerless or always have the in-season flower. That would be sick! That'd be so cool. If you don't give them, then they become rusted parts. Oh. Alright, I didn't know about that. That's good to know. I just thought you found the rusted parts in the... Over there. You know? Do you want Gullivar or Robot? Neither. <laughs> Look at this weird looking forest. I'm very happy with how this turned out. Oh, do you want, like, do you want Gulliver's stuff or do you want the robot? Good point, good point, good point. I mean, I guess you could do both. It'll just take you longer. Hey, did you find them? Got them right here. I don't mind helping Gulliver as much as I mind helping Gullivar. Oh, that's them. Those are definitely my communicator parts. Come here, you little troublemakers. Yay! 
<laughs> I want to redo my island and line the path with, with hero statues. That'd be sick. Alright, the pieces are crammed back in here. Let's see if this thing can send a message. Ahoy there, crew. It's me, your brother from another rudder. So listen, it happened again. Can you swing by to pick me up? Sending my coordinates now. Hey, Demon X, how you doing? <laughs> uh, sending my coordinates now. Gulliver, over now. There, that should do it. I want actual hero statues, aka statues of Link. That'd be so cool if they had, like, more crossover things. You're the best. Thanks for all your help. I promise to return the favor. Be sure to check your mail in a few days. I'm gonna send you something that'll knock your flippers off. Just making sure you- just make sure you put some flippers on before you open it, okay? Ah, uh, I'm saved. Nothing to do now but pace back and forth for the next few hours. Better get started. Alright, bud. Sounds good. What did I get DIY- or not DIY. What did I get points for? I think I actually hit an actual milestone. Yes! Sick. When you come across someone in trouble on the beach, you help them. Setting a fine example for all the island residents, such kindness will sure you surely find its way back to you. I've done it 20 times now. Off-season migratory bird. <laughs> Been better? Oh, that's too bad. Sorry to hear that. You want to talk about it? I'm good. My throat hurts a little bit. I have, like, a thing going on. But besides that, I'm good. Thanks for asking. Do I need to do anything more with the forest? Let's go see. I love the music in here. So good. I don't know if I like the green trees. You know? I think I might have to take out the green trees and swap them out for bunny day trees. Also, I don't like this bush. Goodbye. <laughs> yeah, the bush was a major distraction. I don't like it there. Glad it's gone. <laughs> but I think I might have to take out the trees. Oops, dropped it. Let's eat that instead. Hmm. What do I think about this? You know what? <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> There's a couple reasons why I am gonna keep the tree. First of all, because it doesn't take up as much space as the bunny day trees, and also it creates a nice, like, height contrast, I guess. I will take out this bush as well. Yeah. I need to do some nice paths or floor designs. My path looked blocky. Hmm. That'd be good. What are you thinking? I really enjoy paths that are like this, that have like the original Animal Crossing path design, but like with a whole bunch of things going on. Like flowers and mushrooms and I've seen a lot of cool ones. I also really like this wood pattern. <laughs> what are you done with? Yes, I guess. I will get me a salad. <laughs> Sounds good, you should. Whatever it is that you did, I'm I'm glad you did it. Good job. Oh, uh, what's your homework for today? Good job. Yeah, I don't know what to add to this forest. Do you guys have any like ideas of what it could possibly need? I very I like it a lot, the way it is, but I feel like it's m missing something. I guess or like. It's a little bit cluttered in a way. I think these trees up here aren't helping. I think they make it seem a little too friendly. Nice. Gotcha. Well, 
awesome closet. All right, cool. Yeah, I think I'm gonna get rid of these trees. I think those are messing with me. I think they make it a little too happy instead of eerie. I guess also just the blue sky <laughs> is also not helping. I've got plenty of flowers, still a lot of grass and blocky paths. Need to fill some more spaces, I guess. Yeah, sure. I like using like... Let me show you. Like these little wood patterns that I have back here behind the Tower of Pisa. I feel like those really fill up space nicely. Or like these little star designs. Pretty much anything you can find that would like fill up a single space. I think those are really nice. And they also prevent the flowers from spreading in places they shouldn't spread to. Did I not eat the cherries? I thought I did. <laughs> did I not eat the cherries? What happened? Yeah, I did. And then why can I not pick up the tree? There we go. <laughs> okay, that was weird. I am going to pick up these trees, and then I'm going to take a quick bathroom break after that. Let's pull this one out for a sec. They don't make noise. That's true. They don't make the nice path noise. I mean, you can... I think you can make it make that noise, can't you? Like, if you put the other path under it. Not... It obviously won't work for all paths, but like... No? Ugh, that's annoying. They don't make noise? Yeah. That's annoying. Anyways, I'm gonna be right back, guys. See you guys in, I don't know, a minute. <laughs> be right back. Alright guys, I'm back. Let's turn that back off. <laughs> Where'd my controller go? There it is. <laughs> so yeah, I guess if you wanna 
add more diversity to your island and like less blocky uh, paths. Get one of these. They wind really well and like make it look a little more natural. Let me grab... Let's see here. I think I want another one of those pine trees. See if I have one anywhere that is like not necessary so I don't have to grow one. But yeah, it is a bummer that they don't uh, make the nice sound. Man, I feel like all my pine trees are serving a purpose. How annoying. <laughs> I guess I can take one from somewhere else that I know that I like it there. And then just plant a small one. Wherever. <laughs> Put the shovel down real quick. Check out some beaches. There we go. Too much stuff in here. Oops. Plant some random flowers around here. There we go. Oops, sorry, Molly. No, not Molly. Lolly. <laughs> the hole there for now so I know where to put it when I come back. Go all the way back over to this side. And then I think I want to add it like... Where am I going to put this? I think here. <coughs> <laughs> is where I need the height difference the most. Yeah, I like that better. That really makes it more of like a kind of hidden creepy forest. Old people with phones? <laughs> What's with old people and phones? Do they have any trees? There we go. There's a bunny day tree. Thought I would probably still have one. Come on. <laughs> Don't do this to me. Just let me place the tree. We have a problem. <laughs> now I can't get out. Dang it. Fine. Put the tree back up, and then I'll go stand over here and try to place it and have it tell me I can't do that for some reason. Before I do, I think I want the baby bear back here in the corner. My grandma just called me and was like, did you just send me an, <laughs> an email, WhatsApp? Because for some reason, my name showed as K What's Her Face, not real name before. Oh, that's weird. So like, it didn't show up as your normal name? And my grandma doesn't even know a K What's Her Face. <laughs> that's so weird that it just showed up like with a different name. I have a baby bear, right? I thought I saw one. Oh, there it is. Nice. And then I can place the tree. If I can still find it.
I cannot. Where is it? There it is. He could have just vaulted across the river. I guess I could have, but then I wouldn't have been able to add the baby bear. <laughs> Let's see here. Can I push that backwards? Is it gonna let me? No. But that is a good idea. I think I will vault across the river over here. I didn't think of that. <laughs> there we go. Nope. No. Uh, that's fine. Put this away for now. Where did Uki go? I don't know. <laughs> okay, so I can't really move it anywhere. That's fine. Maybe I can place the baby bear, like, more over here. That'd be nice. That would give me a better spot for it, I think. <laughs> I can never find anything in my inventory! What if I stand over here? Will it let me add the baby bear then? Maybe if you would sort it. Well, I mean, it's mostly when I can't, like, when I picked up an item is when it mostly happens. <laughs> hmm. I have once again got myself stuck. But if you got a base structure, it is easier. Yeah, I guess that's true. Alright, I have an idea. I'll dig up this bush. Jump over. Put the bush back. <laughs> Ta-da! I'm still stuck. <laughs> Dang it. Let me through! Fault. <laughs> Thank you, I hadn't thought of that. There we go. I'm free. And I got the things where I want them to be. Yeah, that helps a lot. I like that much better. Good. Cool, 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 cool. Now I want to... I haven't checked out Able Sisters yet. Let me check out Able Sister real quick. See what we got in there. Maybe some cute prom items. Oh, we have the Harvey skirt thing. Don't like that. <laughs> Alright. Let's see what we got in here today. I don't think I need any doctors or nurses coats. These are cute, the thick striped shirts, but I don't think you guys will ever let me wear them, so I guess I won't get them. Dress is prom today? Wait, is- what? Oh, look at that dress. That's so cute. These slip dresses are pretty. But I don't think I'll ever use them. Oh, the slip dresses prom. I think I have the slip dresses that I wanted from this. I definitely have the yellow one. So then I probably have... There we go. There's the prom crowns. Nice. I was looking for that one yesterday, but they didn't have it. They only had the prom tiaras. So now I get the crowns. Cool, cool, cool. Anything else in here? Why does this look gold? <laughs> I 
Achoo! Excuse me. Ooh. Eh, never mind. Actually, these yellow ones are kind of cute. I think I already have it, but whatever. <laughs> Thank you, yes I guess. I was talking to, um, Trico about that yesterday. How, <laughs> as a person who doesn't really identify with religion, I guess is the most... <laughs> Uh, the best way to say it. I feel awkward saying bless you when people sneeze. So I automatically default to the Dutch Gesundheit. And uh, Trico does that too, but he uses the Dutch uh, or the German Gesundheit. And I thought that was a funny conversation. So <laughs> thanks for bringing it up, I guess. <laughs> Let's see here. Who's crafting today? Uh, Trico doesn't speak German, but it's just one of those things that Americans use frequently. Uh, they use Gesundheit instead of Gesund or uh, instead of Bless You. That's the German one, but I guess you knew that. Yeah, I <laughs> figured. <laughs> I prefer it too. Hi, Molly, aren't you a sweetheart? Don't you look pretty in this house that's all customized just for you? Read your nice little book. I hope you'd stop by, Bunrilla. Please don't call me Bunrilla. <laughs> Wanna chat? I haven't had a chance to talk with Hilsa yet, have you? I hope we meet soon, Bunrilla. <laughs> Cute. Yeah, I guess I accidentally opened his character yesterday. That's probably why they're talking about him. Wait, is no one crafting? None of these villagers are home. Wally isn't home. Leopold's not home. Zell isn't home. Is Croak home? Oh, Croak's home. There we go. Let's see what Croak is up to. There we go. Croak's house is so cool. Annie, it's been too long. You know, you don't need some cockamamie reason to come talk to old Croak, right? Well, I'm just glad you stopped by. Take care now. The house next to it is also having someone in it. Yeah, that was uh, Molly's house, but I didn't realize that Croak was home. I was just in Molly's house. Careful where you're going, okay? Don't be knocking all my stuff over. What you doing? Wait, this thing? I'm making a log dining table. It's tough, but I've got ages of experience. Reckon you need that to be into DIY, fella. Wait, you know how to make a log dining table already? If that's so, I had no idea you were so handy, Annie. You might have to know- you might have the know-how, but do you have the written instructions? Cause it so happens, I got a DIY recipe here you can share around. Thanks. If my log dining table recipe catches on, I th I'll think of you, fella. I'll have to thank you, fella. That's what he said. <laughs> Alright, cool. I also need to get a tree to put here. Let's dump that over here. I'm gonna have you guys over again soon. Pick up some DIYs since I've got quite a few of them now. Alright. I think I want to gift those other two special items of the day, I guess to um, Leopold and Velma. I think they would appreciate the piano and the science set thingy. Here we go, cedar sapling. Just one. That's all I need. Sounds legit. <laughs> I guess so. 
don't know. I just feel like Leopold would like this one since he's kind of like a te teacher type of uh, villager. And Velma has like all the other music stuff, so, you know, she might enjoy that. 53,000. Velma better be happy with this. Alright, let's grab some wrapping paper as well. Wrap those up. Grab one yellow one and one blue one so I can differentiate. I also should be able to get Velma's pretty soon. Is your salad good? What kind of salad do you have? What'd you make? I made a nice salad the other day. I was craving, like, <laughs> shrimp cocktail for some reason. I used to eat that all the time. My dad used to make it often. But, like, as a vegetarian, I don't eat shrimp. So I made, like, this salad with avocado and, like, asparagus and, like, the, the horseradish cocktail dressing type of stuff. And uh, added some tofu instead of shrimp. And actually, it did exactly what I needed it to do. Which was nice. <laughs> it very much satisfied that. Didn't make it. I got one of these ready-made salads that you only got a mix. Ooh, those are good. I really like those. Which one did you get? What's in it? That sounds good too, but I don't like horseradish. Mm. I wonder if you could make it with something else. Oh, I guess I need to hold the shovel, huh? Caesar? Mmm. Sounds good. Alright. Uh, Leopold. Where'd you go, bud? Where are Leopold and Velma? <laughs> Let's see. Let me wrap them first so I can actually differentiate. Oop. Don't drop it. I will make Leopold's yellow. And Velma's blue. There it is. Leopold yellow, Velma blue. Gotta try to remember that. <laughs> there it is. Chicken, croutons, parmesan, lettuce, and a white dressing. Nice. You took them. <laughs> yeah, Caesar salads are good. Easy to make vegetarian too. If you get the, if you get a vegetarian dressing, pretty much done. <laughs> and I guess don't add the chicken. Add something else. Lollies hanging out back here. Come on, I saw Leopold not too long ago. I know they've got to be here somewhere. I'm sure I can tell tofu or maybe I'm sure you can tell tofu or maybe fake chicken yeah exactly any of those would work I came into this for discussions of food and also you do baking streams I read hey Yost Yo Yostel Yostel uh, yes, I do do baking streams. I haven't been doing them as often anymore because they do take quite a bit of energy to set up. But I am planning on doing one soon again. Hoy, stranger. <laughs> Thanks for coming in. What's your favorite food? Actually, I should probably bring that one in a little bit. What's your favorite type of dinner? <laughs> You've gotten it closer than most on your second try. It's jostled, but with a Y. So yossel then. Oh. Cool name. Yossel. Cool. Let's see here. Fan of Italian food? Italian food is always good, honestly. Just so classically tasty. Any specifics that you like a lot? I used to think that, like, pizza was my absolute favorite type of Italian food, but honestly, pasta lately has been, it's been it for me. 
<laughs> I just really love pasta. Also breakfast for dinner since you technically asked what my favorite type of dinner is. I guess that's true. Breakfast for dinner is so good. I don't do it often, but when I do, it's like, it's just nice. In the Netherlands, a common, um, common type of dinner is pancakes, which first of, in the first place I thought was weird, but like, once I kind of got used to that, it's so good. <laughs> chicken parm, chicken alfredo, pizza and pasta with a really good meat sauce. Nice. I'm a vegetarian, so I usually uh, switch them out for some type of plant-based alternative. Eggplant parmesan is so good, though. Leopard miniskirt. Oh gosh, not another one. <laughs> I hate those. Those were so ugly. Really bad for my digestion, but I don't care. I love Italian food. Have you ever been to Italy? I went there in February of last year, when travel wasn't restricted yet. <laughs> and uh, that was my first time ever being... I think my first time ever being in Italy. Definitely first time in Rome. Wonderful. Such a nice time. Wait, that was Velma. <laughs> I've only been to Venice a few years ago. That's right, I've been to Venice before. Wasn't my first time in Italy. First time in Rome, though. <laughs> I thought it sounded weird. I did just pass Velma, yes. <laughs> I was like, oh, you're not who, who I'm looking for. Wait a minute. Actually, you are. How do you do, love? I was just thinking about how lovely it would be to see you. Be afraid. <laughs> Venice is beautiful, but it was... I had a not super great experience in Venice. Mostly because it was just way, way, way too hot. I think it was like 42 degrees or something Celsius when I was there. And like super crowded with uh, tourists and everything. It was not necessarily a good time. Uh, I tried going vegan, but I couldn't give up meat entirely. I practically starved trying to eat non-meats. But I have been without red meat for a couple months now. I still eat chicken, but that's about it. Well, that's good. I'm glad to hear that you're at least trying, you know? I think that's the most important thing. To be aware of the way you eat. Uh, let's see here. Do you want this? <laughs> Was only there for a day? Yeah, me too. When were you there? Was it in summer or in a better season for Venice? Uh, okay. Blue one was for Velma. Because in the summer, it was honestly a bad time. Yeah, it gets really hot there in the summer. What'd you think? Did you enjoy your time there? What a nice wrapping job. Shame I'll be tearing into it right away. An upright piano? There must be some kind of mistake. Is this really for me? How splendid. I've been wanting something like, just like this. Thank you, love. Now where shall I place this for maximum impact? Oh, just thinking about it is so exciting. Well, I can't let, let you go away empty-handed. Take a fitness tank. Jock Annie returns, somehow. <laughs> I enjoyed it that you are almost always surrounded by water helps. That's true. That, is, that does make it better. Annie, our jock. Apparently I'm a frickin' jock. <laughs> they won't leave me alone. They won't allow me to not be a jock. Now where's Leopold? I feel like I've ran across the entire island. Oh, there he is, right behind his house. Hey, friend. At last, it's Annie. What did I do while you were gone? Let's see. I mostly watched kung fu movies in my basement, and then made kung fu movies in my basement. Okay, maybe you need to stop running. That's a decent idea. Just stop running across my island? And then waited for my arms to heal. Did you know that no one can hear me scream from my basement? Excuse me, Leopold, what the heck? <laughs> anyway, welcome back. How often do you hang out with your with other people? Community members, friends, etc. on their on their island or yours? Not often, honestly. I I I don't know. <laughs> Thank you so much for following, I appreciate that. Uh, just curious, that was no 
bearing in this follow I'm, a, I'm about to give you oh okay <laughs> don't, no worries uh, i don't do it too often i just i mean i do go to people's dream islands fairly often but like i feel uncomfortable having people on my island or going to other people's islands mostly because i like feel like either i need to entertain or i need to like follow people on their islands i don't know makes me uncomfortable a little bit so I don't do it too often. Only if there's like an actual reason for it, you know? That's fair, I get it. It was more a question of curiosity than necessity. Oh, that's fine. Don't mind at all. It's a good question. Uh, all right, you got me at my attention. What's up, be afraid? <laughs> Why are they telling me to be afraid? Oh, for real? Yes, sir. Here's your present. Oh, I can't wait to open this. Do my eyes deceive me, or is that a lab experiment set? Sure is, bud. You can just feel the quality in this thing. I wish everything was made out of whatever it's made out of. <laughs> I can't wait to find just the right spot for it in Casa de Leopold. Uh, I used to host catalog parties, and when I start them up again, you're more than welcome to come if you're ever so, so comfortable or inclined. Well, thank you. I appreciate that. It's mostly that, like, I feel uncomfortable when there's no reason for me to come over. Like, if there's, like, an island tour going on or, like, an event going on, then that's fine. But, like, if it's just like, hey, come over to my island and hang out for a bit, I'm like, no thanks. <laughs> Thought that was a three-month follower chat only. Oh my god. <laughs> this was, we were talking about this earlier, how, like, some other streamer had a three-month follower. Like, you had to be following them for three months to be able to chat, like, Yikes. Uh, I can't let you walk away empty-handed after you were so generous to me. Here, you gotta take a soft serve hat, okay? Thanks, bud. Got a soft serve hat. We all know what this looks like, but let me try it on anyways. Oh. Oh, that's a pretty color of purple, though. What else do I have to do on my island? Love this salad. I'm glad you're enjoying your salad. It sounds good. What am I gonna have for lunch? What time is it? Three o'clock? Not too bad. <laughs> time to get battling? Oh, fun. You gonna play some more Pokemon? Then I guess I'll see your name pop up on my screen soon. <laughs> Let's see here. Is there any more that I can do in this area? So I feel like it's almost done, but not... How do I make this eerie all the time? I guess is my main concern for this area. Because, like, now that it's sunny, it doesn't look as eerie anymore. Which is bothering me. Today are the first matches for my... For the for the tournament? Oh, that sounds like fun. How do I make this more eerie? Let me check to see if I have anything interesting in my inventory or that I could craft. Something that just will make it look more off, I guess. Uh, I got another friend who just Let's her community come vibe on her island. No real purpose other than to sit around the plaza. My time on my island is spent doing practical things, so I never have time to just hang out. Yeah, same. But also, like, I feel like if I have people over to just hang out, I need to do something. I need to, like, be entertaining to them. <laughs> you know? So that's more where, where the situation lies, I guess. It's like... You guys are here now. What am I gonna do? What am I gonna show you? I don't know. I'm, I'm sure people aren't expecting me to do something, but it's more like... I don't know what to give you. <laughs> You're here, but I don't know what to make of that. Maybe really we can play hide-and-seek on my island one time? That'd be fun. Ooh, tiki torches? Let me grab a couple tiki torches. That might help the island. 
Let me also put away some things, not the honeybee model. Don't need the statue. Uh, sort your inventory, please. Fine, I'll sort my inventory. <laughs> I will. First of all, I'll put all the things away that I don't need anymore, and then I'll put them all in the right spots. How's that? I'm bringing you something else besides the follow. I hope you don't mind. It uh, depends on what it is. <laughs> oh, nope, want to keep that tiki torch. And put the umbrellas away, put that in storage. Uh, I can't put the tulips away. There's another umbrella that I can put away. Hermite mound can go. Alright. There. Already much better, right? Now that I don't have it fully cluttered with all the things. Now, look at this. Check this out. Check out this next move I got for you. I am going to... Take all the items that I'm going to use and put them down here somewhere. And then I'm going to put the shovels next to each other. <laughs> Why do I have three shovels? <laughs> That's too many shovels. Ooh, a shovel might work actually. That might be cool. My two fishing rods. My two nets. Oh my gosh! Mad K, thank you so much for raiding. <laughs> what a nice surprise. Thank you for being here. How was your stream? Let's see here. Who do we got? A grave, right? Chicken Nuggets, thank you so much for following. I love your name. <laughs> thank you, thank you, Yasold. I appreciate that. The Bad Elf. Hey, how's it going? Mad K, thank you so much for the follow. How are you? How's your stream? Let's see here. Who have I not greeted yet? Jay Weezy, thank you for being here. Thank you for coming in on the raid. Ash of War, thank you so much for following. I really appreciate that. Bad Elf, thank you for following. Great, was also playing some ACNH. Fun! What were you working on? C. Granto, thank you for being here. How are you? Rosie, hey, how you, how's it going? I'm late, but I'm here. Oh, good. Thank you for being here. Thanks, my mom named me this. <laughs> I'm sure she did. She did a very good job. Like your headphones? Thank you. I appreciate that. Duchess and Dub, thank you so much for following. Cool name. C. Grando, thank you for following. Jay Weezy, thank you for following. You guys, thank you so much. You pronounced my name correct? You're welcome. <laughs> I try. Doing well. Had a great random time. Jay Weezy gave me some followers, and I'm going to start a garden Going to wow, can't read. Going to start a garden tomorrow. Been playing for a month, so still just getting started. Oh, fun! I love the early game at Animal Crossing. Have you gotten all the like milestones yet? So check this. When I came in, she was talking about food, and she does or did baking streams. Figured you'd like that for her too. If you like her for that too. Well, thank you so much for bringing uh, for for telling. Mad K to come over here. I appreciate that. Result Ripper is not a good defender of our borders. <laughs> no, it's fine. He's a very good defender of our borders because we got friends in here now. Uh, I also do still do baking streams, just not as frequently as I used to. Head off to. I'm gonna head off to sleep. Peace and good night. Thank you so much for joining in on the raid, and I hope you have a good night. Sweet dreams. It is a noob. Ooh. <laughs> Noobs are welcome. So I have so much to do in it. Oh, fun. I love the early game. It's so, like, nostalgic to me now. <laughs> Obsessed with all things food. What's your favorite type of dinner? Rocking a beautiful two-star island? I'm sure you are. I was just dealing with my inventory here real quick. Because apparently it was annoying. <laughs> Need all the flowers. I don't even think I have all the flowers yet. I think there's a couple types that I don't have yet. Lovely stream as always, but it's Thursday, so I have to go to sleep now. All right, y'all, so thank you so much for bringing the community over here. 
Oh, also, I haven't even given a shout out yet. What kind of host am I? <laughs> Let's see here. There we go. So no battling because today because time zones? What? That sucks. <coughs> It's been a pleasure talking to you, and I hope to catch you again soon. That'd be nice. I, I enjoyed your company. Thank you for being here, and I hope you have a good night. Very basic. I love mac and cheese. Mac and cheese is so good. It, 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 maybe it's a basic, but it's a classic. I also love sandwiches. If we're, if we're going really fancy, though, I love a good fondue or tapas of all sorts of random things. Ooh, tapas are so good. Love sushi, Thai curry. Got you got diverse tastes. I like that. I like it when people don't just stick to one thing. I mean, I guess picky eaters are always going to be around, but I think it's nice when people give lots of things a try. Uh, bad elf. I'm not having people over on my island right now, but maybe another time. Thank you for asking so politely. I appreciate that. Nom nom nom. Thai curry. Thai curry is so good, huh? Ooh, maybe I'll make that for dinner tonight. <laughs> that sounds really good to me. My battle partner is in the U.S. and at work for the next nine hours. No! So I'm asleep at that point. That's annoying. Yeah. You should be asleep at that point, honestly. What time will that be? That's like 12 o'clock here, right? I better wake up to a friend request acceptance. <laughs> Oh yes, food is life. I love cooking too, you know? I just really m enjoy making food. <laughs> That's such a basic thing, I guess, but like, I really do genuinely enjoy it. Yes, I guess, how's this? Not Annie judging my sleep schedule? Oh, I'm not. Not at all. All sorted out. How's that? <laughs> Much better, right? Alright, now that I have some tiki torches, <laughs> let's see what else I can do. So, I'm making kind of like a creepy forest situation with the bunny day items and like whatever else I can find to make it like eerie, I guess. But I'm kind of stuck, I guess. I like don't know what else to add. A shovel, I think, was a good idea. Imagine having a <laughs> having your sleep schedule judged. I sleep from 9 to 10 a.m. until around 2 to 4 p.m. because I work overnight and people feel bad for me when it's honestly, I have never slept better in my life. Well, then I'm happy for you. No judgment, none at all. I feel like I have a fairly normal sleep schedule now. I usually sleep until like 9 to 10 a.m. and go to bed at like 1, I guess. 1 p.m.? Or when- I guess that's also 1 a.m. At least I try to go to bed at 1. Sometimes that doesn't really work out for me. <laughs> Ooh, you know what? Maybe some plain wooden shop signs. As, like, missing signs? Yeah, that might be a little too cliche. We'll see. A grave is a good idea. I think that that'll work out. I don't know if I have enough stones. Goes to bed at 1 p.m. Whatever works for you. <laughs> if it works for you, it is wonderful. For sure. Whatever works, right? Let's see here. What else could I possibly use? I don't need any more bears in there. I already have enough bears. My dog is such a, such a suck. I'm not even paying attention to her. And as soon as I get off, her eyes... She's, wow. She starts growling at me. <laughs> so rude. What kind of dog do you have? Since I no do badling, I will play AC right now. Sounds fun. What are you doing in AC? I try to go to bed after mad raids, but I always wind up vibing to the people she raids. Unfortunately, Thursdays are my, my one early shift every week, and here I am stalling still. <laughs> Well, I appreciate you being here, but if you need to go for, go to bed, for sure, go for it. Jack Russell, uh, Jack, wow, Jack Russell Border Collie. Oh, that sounds really cute. 
sounds like a good breed. Let's see here. What else? What else? What else? What could I use? I still have a million of these bunny day trees. <laughs> hmm. I also don't have a lot of space to fill. Very tiny. Oh, that sounds so sweet. <laughs> I love tiny dogs. They're so cute. Um, a mirror. Yeah. Maybe, but not feeling it. I'm going, muting the tab after this message so I can leave a lurk. Thank you so much for doing that. I appreciate that. Uh, I do have a Discord, yes. Um, you can use the command Discord. Oh, there you go. <laughs> Thanks, yes, I guess. Uh, to join. You're more than welcome to. Whenever I'm walking, we'll bite at my ankles just to get attention. So rude. <laughs> what a rude dog. I'm sure, I'm sure she's a sweetheart still, though. She just wants attention and love. Candles. I don't know. Nothing is really grabbing my eye. Maybe I have something that I can craft that would work out. I already have a whole bunch of alarm clocks in there. I don't know. Floor sign? No. Ducks would make it too cute. Pentagram design. I could, but I think that would be a little over the top. Because I want it to be eerie. Like, the feeling like something's wrong, you know? But not like, obviously something being wrong. Because like, a pentagram design is, is, is a pretty sure sign that something's going on. She'll stand on her two back paws to a random stranger whenever we walk by someone. She just loves attention, doesn't she? I still have a gnome, so I don't think I need that right now. I can always add more, I guess. The black heart is a little too much. Looks at weird, my weird, but <laughs> looks at my bunny day area. Well, ah, yours looks cool. But we're going for different vibes, I think. Yours is like genuinely like meant to look that way, which is really cool. Mine is just meant to look a different way. I have kicks today. Oh, cool. Man, I haven't seen kicks in a very long time. Let's see what I have for DIYs. Maybe I'll find some inspiration in there. I guess an axe could look kind of cool. I have hockey today. Oh, fun. Have you been doing hockey for a long time? Maybe all these NPCs and stuff always come on days you don't stream. Probably, honestly. I feel like there's so many that I just never see. Did I see my NPC for today? I don't think I did. Maybe it's red. About seven years? Wow, cool. I guess you must enjoy it then. Let's see here. I need a flimsy axe, some wood, and an iron nugget for this. I can get those. I already have a flimsy axe. That's convenient. Fire. I have a tiki torch. A couple tiki torches, so I think that'll do enough fire-wise. I think I have something planned today. Oh, cool. What kind of something? What, what kind of something? <laughs> that took me a second to say that correctly. Man, I wish you could put the log stakes, like, upside down. That'd be sick. Oh, some ring fit. Sorry, read that wrong. That's fun. Hmm. Thinking about the hedge sandies. Because it, like, would look fake. And I kind of like the idea of that. Maybe. <laughs> I'll have to think about that one. Birdhouse, some toys, no... I do like these, the destination signposts. Those are kind of weird. Gives off kind of an Alice in Wonderland type of vibe. Been my favorite sport since I was two. Wow, really? And always will be, although my second favorite is basketball. Cool. I used to enjoy basketball too. 
never play anymore, but I don't play any sports really. <laughs> Just don't really have the opportunity to do so anymore. Trash? Maybe. Maybe like a tire stack? Yeah. Not the vibe. Oop. Do you like basketball too? Basketball's fun. I play for the KW Vipers. I'm sorry, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know anything about basketball teams. Can you tell me some more about it, though? I'd love to hear about your team. Maybe I'll, maybe I'll do a gravestone, but it takes up a lot of stone, and also it's very large. I don't know if I have space for it. Pan, no, a gong. <laughs> Stone dogs? Ooh. Stone lion dog. Maybe. That might be good. I'll have to see if I have enough stone. Because that might be a good idea. In any case, I should probably have some of those on my island. They look cool. Roped off areas? Maybe. Do I have any rope fences? I do. Might grab a couple of those. I have nine in storage. I might grab some just for fun, see if they look good. I feel like these are all way too bright and happy, so those won't really give me the vibe that I need. All the fruit things are way too happy. Bees? Tweehee, I'm a sheep. <laughs> Thank you for following, that's such a fun name. Ooh, scattered papers. Seriously? I forgot about this problem, that you need sc scattered papers to make a document stack, and you need a document stack to make scattered papers. Then how am I supposed to get the scattered papers? Annoying. Uh, well, it's a team from KW, Kitchener-Waterloo area. Oh, okay. Let me look it up real quick. KW Vipers is what you said, right? Oh. Uh. <laughs> Not gonna lie, the first the first thing I thought when I saw you guys is uniforms. Uniforms? That's not the right word for it. What's the right word for it? For sports clothing. <laughs> Can't think of it right now. Um, was wildcats? Trickets? I don't know. Is that the word? Jersey. There you go. That's the one. Your jerseys was wildcats? But <laughs> that doesn't make any sense. I really like you guys' logo, though. That looks really cool. I have scattered papers I can send give you. That would be awesome. Thank you so much. You have my uh, friend code now, right? Yeah. If you would, that'd be awesome. I think those would really add to the atmosphere. Boxes? Maybe. Maybe some cardboard boxes. That'd be cool. Um, so I actually have a channel point redemption for my friend code on the Switch. <laughs> so I kind of keep that one as like a little special thingy. Sorry, I know that, like, it's hard to get to my island and, like, have my friend code and stuff. It's just one of those things. Leaves. Yeah, too cute. Hmm. Yeah, no, all the leaves are really cute. I don't think those would do it justice. Although, leaf campfire, maybe. Don't know. Don't know. I just don't want it to be too cluttered as well. I have enough bunny day items already. Alright, so I definitely need some wood, some stone, some iron. Let's grab some stuff. I 
Let me grab some hard wood, some soft wood, and some regular wood, some iron, some stone. Okay, I do have 30 stones, so that's good. I have one tire. Maybe I'll just grab that, just in case. A tail. Yeah, I don't like that it's attached <laughs> to like a base. I wish it was just loose. Oh yeah, the rope fencing, I was gonna grab that. All right. Before I go and put these uh, out into the field, I'm gonna take a quick bathroom break. I will be back in just a minute. See you guys in just a sec. Alright you guys, I'm back. Hey, welcome back mermaid. I uh, can't send you yet because we haven't visited each other yet. Oh, okay. Well, next time then. <laughs> Thank you for trying in any case. I appreciate that. Alrighty. Let's go craft some stuff. Oh, that's right. I had the signs. Do I have any uh, customization kits? Probably in my inventory, but let me just grab some at the store. Let's see here. Grab some customization kits. What is this abomination outfit? Well, you see, I think you should ask... Mostly Uki, I guess, is responsible, but honestly, all of you. <laughs> all of you guys are part of the problem here. I did not choose this. It was bestowed upon me. I refuse to partake in this. Yes, I guess, you were part of this too, don't you even? <laughs> No? I don't know, man. I think you I think you uh might have chosen the mage shoes. But I might be wrong. Could be wrong. I'm innocent. <laughs> Alright. Innocent until proven guilty, I guess. Alright, I think that's enough. I think you might be thinking of a different yes, I guess. <laughs> Ah, of course, of course. The other one. 
Yeah, mermaid, you are innocent. That's true. I need some recommendations on what I should do. Oh, okay. Let's go craft. Do I hear a balloon? No. Maybe I do, but I don't see one. Uh, let's craft. In the first place. Let me craft an axe. Because I think that's fun. <laughs> Do I have just a normal shovel? I don't think I do. Printed design, printed design, printed design. Yeah, I don't really want it to be a floral shovel. That's kind of a lot. <laughs> Ooh. I guess the last one is probably also going to be a floral one, so we'll make a different one. And maybe I can make the other shovel with it. I'm not the best to ask for this. Maybe I made up a whole new theme for my island after I was done. <laughs> What's it look like now? Hey, Red Velvet, how you doing? I like Mika. I haven't listened to Mika in a very long time. Maybe I should. Has he made any new music recently? Alright, got my shovels and stuff. My island is still hide and keep and seek so hide and seek core. Oh cool. Mika's 35 years old. Somehow I thought he'd be older by now. To be honest. <laughs> Let's see. I have enough tiki torches. I already went through this, but I've already forgotten what I wanted, so. Oops. Oh, that's right. I want the signpost. Wait, no, that's Lady Gaga. <laughs> then how old is Mika? I feel like I want a couple of these angled signposts as well. I'll grab like two of these. Wait, but do you mean that you're- were you actually listening to Lady Gaga and said Mika, or- are you actually listening to Mika, but just for some reason thought that they were- What happened? I guess is my question. <laughs> what happened there? What's the truth? <laughs> Lady Gaga is 35 years old. Okay. That's good to know. Ooh, I could craft a cutting board. Nah. I was listening to Mika, but Lady Gaga is 35 years old. Okay. The truth comes out. <laughs> Eventually. Fire toy. I think I do want this. Nah, decoy duck would be cute. I was thinking about the decoy duck, but I think that would look a little too cute for the area. Let's see, what else can I make? Yeah, I don't think I'll make the western style stone. I don't know if the dog will suit the area, but I'm sure I can find a place for it if it doesn't. In any case, it's I think it's good to have one. <laughs> Let's see here, what else? You would think these like iron things would look creepy, but they really don't. I guess maybe the frying pan, but... Nah. This, like, pipe would be kind of cool. Hmm. The kettlebell? I don't know. Not a bad idea, just I'm not sure. All this stuff is too bright and happy. Oh, that's right. I was thinking of the cardboard boxes. Got assignments done? Good job! Good 
it work? Bamboo stuff is too cute. Cherry blossom stuff is too cute. Shell stuff is too cute. I do like this one, but I don't think I have any more of those skinny mushrooms. Those would work well. I'll check if I have any skinny mushrooms. My dog wants a belly rub? Well then give her a belly rub. She deserves it, she's a good girl. Skinny mushrooms and clay. I'll check to see if I have any of those, but I don't think I do. I think I've probably used those all up. I don't think I have the DIY for that, or any mush item in general. Yeah, mush that I really love the mushroom items so much so that I like have gone back in time multiple times to go and get more mushrooms. But they're kind of hard to forage, honestly. <laughs> Were you playing in, uh... Wow. <laughs> that sounded weird. Were you playing in the fall? Because that's when you get them. Got mushrooms, just not the DIYs. Oh, that's a bummer. Oh, dang it. I only have four skinny mushrooms. Dang. Alright. No mushroom lamp for now. <laughs> that's okay. Huh. That's weird that you didn't get any of the DIYs. I mean, I don't- I for sure didn't get all of them, but I got quite a few. Alright, no mushroom lamps for now. That's okay. Let me customize some stuff and then we'll go put them down. Hello. <laughs> Look at Zell! Look at how cute with his little spring outfit and his basket. Looks like he's gonna go pick some flowers. Alright, I definitely wanna deal with bees, because I do not need them to be bears. I think I'll keep the dark wood. What kind of custom design could I put on here? Anything good? <laughs> that looks kind of cute. <laughs> kind of like that. Uh, I got the mush mushroom wreath, but I think you got that from Isabel. Yeah, that's right. Huh, that's weird that you didn't get any. Don't really have any custom designs that I like for this. I mean, I guess this target is kind of fun. No. Don't like them. I think this bright yellow warning sign is kind of cool. Kind of jarring eh, compared to the other things, but I like that. I got the general fall DIYs, just not the mush. Oh, that sucks. Yeah, I feel like they were really hard to get. They took me a while, too. I remember going back and, like, getting more. Why does this one just... start off with a moon design on it? I'll make another one with the warning sign on it. I didn't- I don't think I got many of the fall designs either, actually, now that I think of it. The DIYs. Tire toy, I want to keep, I think, that color, but let me check if they have, like, some- if they make it look, like, used or dirty at all. No. I'll just keep it black, then. Ooh! Oh, sick. Can make it mossy. I like that. Just checking out what it, what's in the cranny today. Oh, what'd you get? Uh, I restarted my island again. Made Disneyland again. But now it won't be like a theme park. More like an actual Disney universe. Wow, that sounds really cool. I liked your original Disney island. That was really cool. Want to change my craft room? Go for it. Everything? You got everything in Nook's Cranny? Uh, continue customizing. Ooh, uh, what am I gonna make this? Sailors. I guess this one. Good enough. It'll work. Let's 
see here. What else do I still have going on? Another angled sink signpost. I'll make that the florist as well. I like these signposts for like the idea of like more of a wonder like Wonderland situation. Ooh. White or black? Both look really cool. Colored. Oh, heck, these are all cool. I didn't realize you could customize them so cool. The white would look good in the forest. But I think the black would be really... I think old. I think old is the way to go. Finally, one decade, one decade of my music collection roughly sorted. Wow, that sounds like a lot of work. I remember you telling me about that yesterday. Cool. Wait, there's some mushrooms here as well. Yeah, only a couple round mushrooms. Oh, my inventory's all filled up as well. Oh, I already have it. Yummy, your balloon. Gotcha. Wait, what the heck? Okay, fine. No reason for it to just bounce into nowhere, but that's fine, I guess. All right, now let's make this a little more Wonderland. Where do I need some tall stuff? I think, like right over here? Yeah, no, that won't be tall enough. Right here is where I need something tall. But I need to make sure I can still go through. My storage is full already? Like your your normal storage? Do you have it um enlarged, I guess? <laughs> I can't think of the word, but do you have the bigger one? Oh, that's the smaller storage, right? I figured I should start off with the best decade for nostalgia. For nostalgia reason, which is of course the zeros. Agreed! So much good music from that time. Okay, if I put it here, it doesn't work. Then I can't move. Now I have the 80s, 90s, and 10s to go. Upgraded? <laughs> uh, yeah, you can upgrade your... Um... Your inventory now. This isn't working. Maybe I'll take away the bear. Or something. What's here? That's not in the way. Can I put the music player somewhere else? So it won't be so in the way? Oh, come on. Really? <laughs> Oh, it is the bigger one. Dang, that sucks. It's not Wonderland, it's Zipperland, which is a much weirder and creepier place. Yeah, exactly. I can't believe I outgrown my hair to look like hockey hair. Hockey hair? Is that like a specific, I guess, vibe? <laughs> I didn't realize hockey hair was a thing. I know that I have that and it's so full. Oh no! Now what? I guess you'll have to get rid of things. Wavy long in the back. Oh, okay. Sounds pretty. Let me uh, place the design. I hear a balloon and I don't feel like grabbing it. There we go. Yeah, maybe I will. Actually, I don't see it. Oh, there it is. Is it gonna fly over here, or is it already overhead? Oh yeah, it's gonna fly over here. Alright, I can grab that then. Didn't know that was called hockey hair. Yeah, me neither. <laughs> Interesting, though. I guess that makes sense. Come on. There we go. 
not into the nothingness this time. Except for my pockets being full. Let's see what we got. Another 10,000 bells. Interesting. I keep getting that. Or like, large amounts of bells in general. I mean, maybe I don't need the music player here. Sounds like it's already working. I can't get around. Time to sell? Sounds like a good idea. Oh my gosh. My in my pockets being full is so annoying. Let's drop this real quick. Then we'll grab this. Alright, I'll stretch. Thank you, bad elf. Oh, and puppy cam. It's time. Thank you for the stretch. Could really use that. Let's go for some puppy cam. There we go. Oh! They're all in their cages. Why is that? Where are they going? Where are my friends going? Where are you taking them? <laughs> Why? Friends, are you okay? Are you being held hostage? Yes. <laughs> Where are they taking you, my friends? In the meantime, I'm just gonna <laughs> finish off some things on my island. Since I do kinda gotta get going soon. Let's see here. Well, do we want fruit bird cam instead or do you want your uh your points back because this is kind of not really that interesting unless we just want to keep watching the puppies being kidnapped i guess that works too whichever you prefer <laughs> we can do whatever This is depressing. Yeah, exactly. This is kind of not so fun. So, like, we can do something else. Let's go to Fruit Bird. See what they're up to. See if we get any Fruit Bird. Alright, I will give you your points back and we'll also check out the Fruit Birds for a minute. Not any fruit birds right now. That's too bad. <laughs> the animals just don't want to come out today. Bring that puppy cam back. There we go. Yeah. No birds, no puppies. Dang it. This may be about starting to separate mothers and puppies so they learn to be apart. Yeah, maybe. Could be. In any case, feels sad. <laughs> Alright. Well, in any case, you got your points back, and we got a little bit of bird cam. I'm gonna take out these flowers, because I can't put the signpost in here. And honestly, they're not doing much good here anyways. Swap. There we go. Then we gotta keep watching this ducky with the weird outfit. I guess so. Sorry to subject you to this. plants. Not much longer, though. 
I won't keep you uh, hostage in this situation. You will have to continue to look at this creepy forest, though. Put away. Alright, guys. I think I'm also gonna get going pretty soon. Do you guys have any requests for who I should raid? Let me know. I'm excited to hear what you guys, uh, what you got for me. I wonder if I can put a tiki torch back here. That might be kind of cool. Let's see if that looks good. I think that might be a little much. Yeah, I guess just one tiki torch is kind of good. Jari? Uh, I only have a couple things that I request, I guess is that they have their camera on and that they speak English and uh, I also like knowing what they're playing. Angled signpost. Let's put that over here. I think we need something a little lower over here. Can, can I really not push that? Do they have both? Alright, I will check them out. Jari. Ooh, we could also go to Kate Latte. She's really cute. And Ada can. We can raid Animal Crossing. She's nice. Thank you. Oh, I don't think we should go to Jari. Just because she already has 182 people watching. I prefer streaming, especially with the amount of viewers I have right now. I'd prefer to raid someone a little bit smaller than that, if you don't mind. She seems really cool, though. But maybe, maybe another time when uh, I can't do so much good for someone else. I was thinking either Tea Kitty or Kate Latte. Kate Latte was really fun the other day. She's playing Celeste. Although I did just raid her. Sure, let's go for Tea Kitty. <laughs> She's playing Breath of the Wild. Flapjack Daisy. Let me check. Oh, actually, that's a good idea. You know what? Yeah, sure. Let's go to Flapjack Jacob. They have 17 people watching right now. That's good. That's someone I can do a lot of good to. Alright guys, well, in that case, I think this will pretty much be it for today. I am gonna go have some lunch and stuff. Deal with homework. You know, all the things. Thank you guys so much for being here. If you're new here and aren't following yet and had a good time, I would love it if you would. Um, if anyone wants to join the Discord, you're more than welcome to by using the command Discord in the chat. Yeah, thank you guys so much for being here. I hope you have a great day or night or whichever time it is for you. Have a good time zone. Thank you for sharing that, yes I guess. And uh, send some love to Flap Flapjack Jacob. I'm sure they're, uh, they're pretty cool. <laughs> Looks like it, at least. <laughs> thank you guys once again for being here, and I'll see y'all next time. Let me, uh, start this raid. Bye, everyone. Thanks for being here. See you next time. Let's close this off. Bye, guys. <laughs>